Okay, hi, I'm Larry Hankin. You probably recognize me from a lot of stuff I've done on TV. Seinfeld, I stole the raisins, remember that? I ate the raisins, I really did. And the Friends, I'm Mr. Heckles, the weird guy from upstairs. And I just was on Breaking Bad as a guy, you know, in the junkyard. I also destroyed the Winnebago, that was me. And Billy Madison and stuff like that. So I've been in a lot of stuff, you probably see me around, but now I wanna make my own films and I wanna make a feature. I'm gonna make a movie. This is a, a feature, it's small, but it's a major feature. By the way, I'm in a friend's kitchen here. This is the, the friend's kitchen. In case uh, anybody uh, wondered where I am, I'm in a friend's kitchen. Okay, so anyway, what the story is about is there's a guy, a guy named Emmett Sagittarius Demas. He's a homeless guy, and he lives on the beach in Venice, California. Want to know a very interesting fact about female frogs? Want to hear a story? A poem? Anything? And the way he makes a living is he tells poems and stories and rants for anywhere from a quarter to $2.99. How you doing, sir? You want a poem, a story, a rant uh, while you drive? Uh, this guy, Larry Hankin, steals his stories. He's a thief, he's a goner. This here is now, this is Emmett. Uh, Emmett Sagittarius Demas. I don't know, they, people steal, you know. Uh, they give me a quarter and they think they own the world. Larry Hankin is stealing his poems and going on television and, and making movies about him and he's making a lot of money according to this homeless guy, Emmett Sagittarius Demas. Bounty hunting's where it's at. He steals from me, you know? I tell him all these stories, then he tells somebody else, you know? Sometimes Jones is uh, 14 years old. Well, he starts out 14. Uh, sometimes Jones had a magic credit card, you know? That's mine. Uh, what do you call people who steal other people's intellectual property? Plagiarist. Plagiarist! That's what Larry Hankin is. He's a plagiarist. It's a patent infringement. And it's just not fair. It's just not fair. Emmett wants his due. He wants to be paid for his intellectual property. He wants to sue this guy for pain and suffering. And he wants to punch him in the snot locker. And he wants to talk to him and get this thing settled. I'm working my imagination to the bone. Not a check, not a money order, nothing, not a zip, zero, zilch. Larry Hankin comes into town one day. He's gonna be there for one night. And he's going on at eight o'clock. And Emmett has got to get to that show, and Emmett wants his intellectual property back and his residuals. The story is about the trials and tribulations of a homeless poet trying to get to the guy who's stealing his stuff, okay? It's not, it's not fair, you know? The trick is that I'm going to play both parts. I'm going to play Emmett. Whatever, you know. And I'm also going to play Larry Hankin. It's a stretch, but I think I'm old enough and I can do it. Um, okay, that's it. Now, I've been making my own film shorts. I've done three Emmett Demas films, shorts, 10 minutes each. They got some prizes, were in some festivals. The first one was The Outlaw Emmett Demas with Edie McClurg, where she was stuck on the side of a road. So Emmett Demas picks her up and takes her to uh, the next gas station. And on the way, they're stopped by a cop. May I see your driver's license and registration? And Emmett steals his badge. And then some bikers come along and hassle him, and there's a fight. And then the next one I did was the outlaw Emmett Demas and the porno queen. And that's where he breaks a friend of his out of an old age home and uh, they get lost. So he stops at a garage where he sees some motorcycles uh, out in front and he discovers there's a woman being kidnapped and held hostage inside the garage. So Emmett gets the idea that he's going to collect the reward, become a bounty hunter and capture these guys. Let's go, miss. Let's go. Can I just give him a blowjob? But it turns out that it's just some bikers making some homemade porno movie in their garage. And they get pretty pissed off and there's this fight. Emmett gets the shit kicked out of him. On the other hand, he makes some money because they filmed the fight and he gets paid as an actor. So everything works out. And then the last movie that I did about Emmett Demas was called Emmett Demas and Willie Jones, where Emmett gets a friend, it's a 25-year-old pickpocket who's just out of juvie. As soon as we catch any one of those wanted poster guys, we'll have everything we need. That's what you've been saying for the last 2,000 miles. And they decide to head to Sturgis, and then they pick up this guy who's got a flat tire because they gave it to him, figuring they'll charge him 60 bucks to get him to the next gas station. And that kind of doesn't work out because the guy has a gun. Say, what's the reward situation on you, bro? Laughter ensues after a lot of close calls. 
Sally's Diner was another film short that I made a long time ago, and that got an Academy Award nomination. And it was about the homeless guy who goes into a diner at four o'clock in the morning, and he gets caught in the middle of a robbery. Don't move, act normal or I'll kill you. I'll split the money with you 50-50, I'll leave, you keep whatever else you find in here. Now that's fair. Just to get a meal, he has to stop the robbery. What'd you do that for? And now I want to do the long form. And this one is just a low budget, nice and easy, in Venice. Emmett's homeless and he's a poet and somebody has stolen his work. Actually me. Check out these cool incentives. Uh, there's going to be some t-shirts. There's going to be a DVD of the show that Larry stole that I actually do on stage in front of college students. And here's the best part. For one of you guys or girls or old people, here's the special deal. One of you contributors is going to be in the movie. How's about that? It's going to be really cool. Your friends will recognize you. It's not going to be way in the background. You're going to probably um, have a medium shot. A close-up, we'll talk about it. You know, everybody's going to get their 15 minutes of fame, right? Well, that's, that's bullshit, you know? And the title of the film is Larry Hankin's Street Stories. And it's about how Larry Hankin stole all those street stories from a homeless poet. How low can you get, Larry? Come on.